Welcome back to another video, and this is going to be part 7 of the quarry. I'm feeling better. Last video, I wasn't feeling too bad, too good. This video is it's starting to speed up. It's starting to get more horror, and it's nighttime, and let's start it up, man. I don't think I, I don't think I lost anyone yet. I think everybody may still be alive. Let's go. Fun game. Technique needs work. Hey. Uh, yeah. I guess you're done for that. Of course. <sighs> Sleeping down here was a little more fun when we thought we could get caught, huh? Yeah, I, uh, I guess. Jacob, I thought we agreed that this, us, was just supposed to be some summer fun. No, no. I know. I just... You just love having an audience, huh? Oh, Jacob. I mean, you do, I can't believe you... You fucking Frenched him! You know, in front of everyone! Jesus wept! French? Are we 12? No, but Nick is. Kind of. You know, I love the guy, but I don't think he's actually ever seen a girl naked before. Well, I hate to break it to you, but he just had his tongue down my throat, and he definitely knew what to do with it. You, you really love fucking with me, huh? Lighten up, Sarapus, please. <laughs> this is not how the night was supposed to go. What? You know what? Nothing. No Nothing. Never mind. Fine. You can stand here, sulking. Heavy Driving issue yourself she got. crazy imagining Nick's tongue in my mouth. Oh, come on. Or you can go grab us some towels. What do you need towels for? Well, we agreed. Some are fun, right? Apparently, summer is not quite over. Okay. Grab this. Oh, hold on. Huh. It's not long ago. Wonder if it was near here.
Check it and thack it, huh? Oh, well, check it must mean Mr. H. Chris Hackett. Who the hell is Thackett? Well, that look, that look like the cop, bro. They brothers? Zero. You dick. God, what the hell? Get back down here, Jacob. Hmm. What are these numbers? Someone up there? Yeah, I'm gonna go with probably everything's fine. I guess we could just like drip dry or and you could shake it out doggy style. Wow, you really <laughs> know how to talk to a girl, don't you? <laughs> Look, you can't just pretend that it didn't happen. Oh, but I can because you see, oh help! Help! I'm I'm drowning and I I need a big, strong, not at all insecure man to come save me. <laughs> huh. No. Okay. What's this? A female in need? Fear not, fragile thing, for Hurricane Jake is here! Cannonball! Oh! 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 oh. Cold, cold, cold. Oh, cold. Oh. Hurricane Jake. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, now you're gonna get it. See? <laughs> <laughs> hey, switch! Oh, stop being uh drunk. Attack! Move. Look, I don't want this to end. <laughs> I'd be happy to stay out here all summer, but I think we'd get a little pruny. Oh, you know what I mean, like 
Give me this. Jacob, I had a great summer with you. Well, it doesn't just have to be the summer. <laughs> Jacob. Okay, oh, look, how about this? Um, <clears throat> if I can do a backflip off of here, you let me come visit you, okay? How about that? Right. Hey! Where are you going? Come on! Damn. Back down and get it, bro. Shit. Damn. I should have went for it. That was some mighty fine social disruption there, Kaylin, I have to say. Ah, or was it just the nudge that Abby needed? You're an evil genius. Who do you think is gonna make the first move? Nick or Abby? Ooh, good cue. My bet's on either. I don't know, Nick's got the beast in him. Uh, if by beast you mean some sort of mild-mannered baby deer. Hey, don't let the cute preppy aesthetic fool you. It's like a steel barbecue grill under that shirt. <laughs> so, you noticed that too, huh? So, what do you guys want to do now? We can keep playing. Yeah? Just the three of us? Alright, Dylan. Truth or... Uh, I sound like Abby. Oh my gosh. Uh, we gotta help her. <laughs> Wait, where did it come from? This way. Come on. Abby! Help! Please! Nick! Help him! Where's Nick? I... Go after Nick! Okay, I got this. That shotgun's got a hell of a spread. Be careful.
take shortcut follow <laughs> Oh damn. Oh man that rock was right there. I moved this way. Follow path, bro. your ankle up. Come on, bro. What you doing? I can't even see what the... Let's get back to the fire. Naked girl waiting for you back there, Jacob. What are you doing? Okay. Okay. Whoa. Why he called out? I didn't press call out. Man, just, just let me down, okay? Just don't hurt me, please. Oh, Jesus Christ, what the fuck are you doing? They cool, they just trying to catch them things. That's what I feel. If you close your eyes. Oh, oh. What are you doing? Shh. Stop. Help. Shh. Help. 
tastes bad, don't it? It's for your own good. Where are you off to now, girly? What the fuck? I think I definitely gotta do an hour long fuck. video on this. Okay, I made the right decision. Seems like just a blink and you're back to see me again. So, then, what have we got? It's the star. Stars, stars in the night, sky, beacons of light, dreams of hope, purpose, or a reminder of our insignificance. Fear of despair, trust in the light of the star, with it comes clarity, and sometimes truth. The tower. Jump free of your troubles. Fight or flight? That's the question we all ask ourselves, but often when leaping out of danger, we're still faced with certain peril. Yeah. Watch your step. It could be your last. Remember, there's always more than meets the eye. Would you like me to show you? I don't want to see nothing. No? Okay. If that's what you want. I'm going to do it on my own. Back to it then. Back to Hackett's Quarry. Back to Hackett's Quarry you go. Oh, the fun you'll have. It was, it, it was, I, I, I don't even know what it was. It was so fast, and, and there was a, uh, there was a hunter, and it was just. Oh, Abby. Here. What? Oh, try drawing. Drawing what? Oh, can you draw what attacked you? Okay, so far everybody's still alive. Nick, hey, buddy, can you tell us what happened? I'm all attacked. Where's Happy? Super out of it, man. We need to know what happened. All right. There was there was a guy there, but there was some kind of some kind of animal. The hell? What the fucking kind of animal does this? Did I, did I get it? Is Abby? Yeah, hey, she, hey, she's okay, dude. She's right over there. Because teeth were on top of me. I think it was a bear. Full size bear would have crushed him. There's no way. I thought we don't get bears right here. No, uh, Oh fuck! Look at that! Oh fuck. shit! That black stuff—that's that's infection. That's and it's it, it's spreading. This is bad. This is really bad, dude. Uh, so, uh, sorry. Uh, You're okay. It's okay. Mm, fuck that. Hurt. We should amputate. We should cut it off before the infection spreads. What? Why would we do that? I don't know, man. Look at that black stuff. What? What do you think it is? Do I look like a doctor? 
Why are you talking about cut the leg off then? If you adopt it. I know how to use it. Sort of. Brian, what if it's Jacob or Emma? What if it's not? Be careful. It was probably nothing. They give you no time to look yeah. around, bro. But is it gone? Yeah, you better run. Very brave. All right. So, uh, law just sounding pretty good right about now, yeah? Wait, no, 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 no. Don't shoot, don't shoot. I'm about to blow you, bro. I ain't lying. Pause. Pause. Holy shit. Nick. Is he okay? Nick and Abby were attacked. In the woods. Hey, does anybody have any dry clothes? I'm, I'm fucking freezing. All our bags are still in the minivan. Oh, fuck, of course they are. Jacob, where's Emma? Oh, Jesus Christ, um, I, I left Emma on the island, and I told her I'd be right back. Ouch. Wait, the island? Yeah, why? Well, no, I just, I just thought I saw someone over there before. Someone? No, I, you know, I, I don't know, it's, it's probably nothing. God, I left her out there alone. Well, I think we're gonna head to the lodge. Also, why are you covered in... What I hope is strawberry jelly. Oh, yeah, no, um, I'm pretty sure it's blood. It was this guy with like, um, he had like a bottle thing. I don't know, dude. It's like a really long story. Ew. Yeah, no, it's super fucked up. I gotta go get Emma. Uh, excuse me? Hey, I need this, okay? It's not safe out there. Dude, we gotta protect Nick and Abby. Yeah, and I need to save Emma, all right? She's out there alone. You don't even know if she's in trouble. You don't even know if you're in trouble. Are you trying to piss me off? No, I'm trying to save my girlfriend's life, asshole. Yeah, I don't think she's your girlfriend, dude. What? Get... I, it, I was trying to give it to him. No, no, I wasn't trying to hit him in the guys. face. You're acting like pricks, both of you. Jacob, we're keeping this. Nick and Abby are injured. We need protection. There's someone around here. <laughs> Brian. Sorry. This is bullshit. Make sure she's safe. If she's on the island, she's definitely fine. And what? Risk another uh, run in with Captain Deliverance? No thanks, okay? There's probably another boat by the zip line. Either way, I can make it to the island from there. We need to get back to the lodge. Try to get help. How? Nick can't walk properly. But yeah, I have an idea. See what Tanae brings. Okay, here's a riddle for you. What's got two thumbs and is suddenly riding solo on a freaky island in the dark? This fool, well, one thumb, one available thumb. Okay. And it was here, 
on this strange, uninhabited island that this brave young soul found herself. Okay, full disclosure, I've suddenly found myself on a, a strange, tiny little island all alone with nothing to do but show you guys around. So, there's a tree house over there. I'm gonna go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. Because here's the thing, not that I want to go back because I don't, but even if I did, I can't because then I'd look like the super needy one when he was the one who, who stormed off in the first place. God, you know what? Sorry, I'm bending. Well, explore bending. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do it. To the treehouse, fellow explorers. <laughs> No prizes for guessing what these are. Can't say that I've used them. A little too au naturel for me, TBH. You know, I've never thought about where the waste goes. Oh. Oh, please, God, no. <laughs> okay, we're gonna just go ahead and ignore that. And this is the meeting shelter. It's a shelter where you meet at. Okay, I'm trying really hard to make this interesting, but sometimes a thing just is what it is. I think I've made my point. So this island is like an unexcavated part of the quarry that rewilded itself after it flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, that squirrel huh? squirrel me. You know, when I was little, I used to think that islands just kind of would float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser now and realize that not everything's always as it seems. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man child. He's all sad because you don't want to go steady with him and write him love letters every freaking day. And while we're talking about it, you don't mind that we're talking about it, right? Why, why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all bluff about it, you know? <sighs> oh, look. A metaphor in the narrative by mean a fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I... Take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and keep ranting about my stupid dumb life? I guess since this isn't live, the choice is up to me. Ah, oh, what the hell. We're in it now anyway. Well and truly in the thick of it. Because you know what else? I was really excited for the next part of my life, you know? I mean, the summer was great, but what's next? I mean, come on. I know by the time I post this, Hackett's Quarry will just be but a distant memory, and you know it's just one night, and you have to make the most of all your opportunities, and yada, yada, yada. I guess I just don't want to have to settle for what's around me, you know? <sighs> Abby sees me as this confident person, but really? I'm just desperate to stay afloat in a world where everyone wants to be different.
Something probably gonna run across and try to scare me. This is actually kind of fun. I feel like this is the first time I've been alone all summer. Kind of like it. I guess that kind of reinforces the whole Jacob thing. I know the plan was for him to come get me, but now that I'm by myself, I kind of like it. Sorry, Jacob, if you're watching. Nothing personal. It's a me thing. We're cool, right? Yeah, we're cool. She's hot. Ooh. I mean, who knows? Maybe in 50 years we'll bump into each other and be flooded with fond memories of that one amazing summer at Hackett's Quarry summer camp. And that spark that changed our lives forever. Then we'll be like 70 year old lovers or whatever and have crazy walker sex. <laughs> hey, it could happen. Only time will tell, Jakey boy. And as they say, time makes fools of us all. But we will be the oldest, sexiest fools there ever were. <laughs> Until then, I gotta do my thing. Sorry, buddy. about it. How could this have been Mr. H when he was back at the lodge? Quoth the raven nevermore. Wow, they really let you um, walk around a lot, explore. Guess I gotta do this one handed, huh? That didn't sound great. <laughs> oh, shit. Come on. is the luxurious Skyway Treehouse, obviously. Constructed in the year 1805 by a blindfolded man who used only the finest rotting wood, rusty nails, and donkey spit that money could buy. A real Hackett vintage classic. Honey, I'm home. What's that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well now, that's a fine how do you do. Take it all in, folks. 
That's the summer camp experience right there, and... Oh, look. It seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. It seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. I guess one of the kids left their stuff, or maybe one of the guys back there? But... I don't recognize oh, this. shit. Did you hear that? Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belongings? Or do we open the spooky trap door and die a horrible, painful death? There are literally no right answers. Mm, search your bag. Bag it is. And you know what? I'm putting some clothes on. This is all you're getting. there's something up there and it is not gonna make me jump I can promise you that much it ain't nothing but win baby <laughs> goodbye cruel world the final curtain is calling and there's no time for an encore oh shit Damn, I saw that window. Bikes gonna hold it. Easy. I got it. He's okay. Are you in pain? No. Yeah, that's no, what I'm sorry. Saying. I'm, just, I'm really hungry. We'll get you some food inside, okay? Man, I can eat a horse. Man, I can eat a horse. Well, I don't know if we'll be able to find you a horse, but maybe some granola. Oh, yuck! I hate granola. <laughs> this will open the nurse's station. Should be plenty of stuff in there. 
Well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned up for now. I'll get you something neat. You and I are gonna find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yup. We'll come meet you. Copy that. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I really hope they're gonna be okay. Do you think that whatever's left in the nurse's office is gonna cut it? Caitlin knows what she's doing. Does she? I, I mean, she wasn't even supposed to be working at the nurse's office this summer. She only filled in because some other girl didn't show up. It's better than nothing. <sighs> Come on, let's go call for backup. It's pretty weird to see this place so dead. You never came down here at night while camp was in session? What? No, did you? A couple times, yeah. Where are you going? I, I... I... I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. I don't think Nick's injuries are as bad as we thought. Well, that's good news. Yeah. So what now? Yeah, I mean, you're walking around. We got a call for help. Who should I call? Uh, Mr. H? The only number I got is to this phone. Okay, then 911. You mean 911? <laughs> Who says 911? I don't know. I... Anyway, yeah, but like what? Should I ask for like police, ambulance? Huh. Cops with guns. We need a lot of backup out here. So they'll say 911. What's your emergency? And then I say, uh, help. My friends may have been attacked by a bear. Or maybe not a bear, but definitely an animal with teeth. And we're not sure how many there are out there or how smart they are. So it's very possible they might be mounting an attack on us right now. And we really need backup. Come on, man. Stop clowning. You know what to do. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's good. Okay. What's wrong? Dead. Well, did you hang up? How could I have hung up? I don't know. You know, maybe you slipped and hung up or something. Do you know how phones work? Yeah, of course. Real phones, not cell phones? Do you know how phones work? Okay, well, you broke it. I did not. <sighs> okay, so this phone's a no-go. No one has signal. Is there anywhere else in the camp that has a landline? Well, not a landline. What? The radio hut has some old broadcast gear. Where, where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably break something up and get a message out. All right, yeah. Let's, let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. You gotta be fucking crazy if you think I'm gonna go out there without something to defend myself. It's more of a safety concern. Oh, do you think I'm gonna shoot my eye out? Or your whole head. Don't be a dick, man. I know how to use this. Yeah, man, with that this is shit going on and uh, put the gun back. Okay. Uh... It's, it's 
Probably the weather. The what weather, weather Ryan? Maybe, maybe it was the bears. Bear. And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay, so for the sake of argument, what if that bear that uh, cut our phone line and just cut out all the power, what if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Fair point. Thank you. We should probably tell Caitlin that we're going to the radio hut. They're probably freaks. Yeah, okay, yeah, let's go. Oh my god. Yeah, we should probably leave that with Caitlin. And that's it for the video. Remember to like, share, subscribe, and beat. And remember every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, I upload videos of the quarry. Thank you for watching.